Hi, I'm Rachel Presky. I'm a freelance illustrator from the UK based just outside of London. My earliest memory of illustration is probably as a kid I used to draw over the like kind of trace over the Winnie the Pooh illustrations in the books. Um, yes, they were just my favourite. Winnie the Pooh has always been my favourite. I still live in that, so yeah. <laughs> I decided to become an illustrator after I was made redundant uh, a couple of years ago. I had been doing some illustration part-time but uh, it was the right time for me to take the leap to become a full-time illustrator and I've been doing it since. Uh, my inspiration really comes from my day-to-day -day life and also the work that I get given from clients. So. Um, I'll say what have I been doing today basically it sounds really ridiculous but you know sometimes I'll draw I had a really fun yoga session so I'll draw a pose from a yoga session or things like that. I describe my style as contemporary digital illustration um, I tend to always include figures and I also tend to stick to the same colour palette um, and that really creates a cohesive sense of style throughout my work. So the collection that can be seen in the book is actually a series of personal work I've done um, over the years and they're all different pieces. They've, some of them have come from a word that I've then drawn something based on that word or a couple of others are from little briefs I've set myself and the culmination of all of those has led to my Adobe Stock portfolio. I usually print my work for prints and postcards and cards and things like that that I would sell then on um, Etsy and other sh and my personal website shop. And I use kind of a selection of different papers, but mostly I really like using like a heavy paper stock with a watercolory textured finish, um, and it actually prevents the ink from bleeding a lot and also it, it gives my work a bit of a texture so it kind of makes it look a bit more real and it makes it look like it's hand painted which is really cool. For anyone that's looking to make a start in illustration I just say just start drawing. Um, draw as much as you can, draw as many things as you can. Like if you can take life drawing classes and classes like that and really hone your skills in and then you can start playing with the different size of the legs, different size of heads if you're doing people um, and then just draw things around you and it's really fun so the more you do it and the more fun you have with it the better your image is going to be too. <laughs> <laughs>